at 15 seconds. Guidance is internal. 12, 11, 10, 9. Ignition sequence start. 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, 0. All engine running. We have a liftoff. Liftoff on Apollo 11. everybody thank you for joining me tonight it is free silver half dollar hunts for the chat and what that means is I've got four boxes of half dollars 500 bucks in each box you've got the one up in the corner there and you can see the other three behind me we give uh, each hunt wiener 10 rolls to hunt yeah we've increased it it was five rolls figure out we see how that went then we bumped it up to eight. Now we're bumping it up to 10 rolls. Uh, so no purchase necessary. All you have to do is be over 18 and live in the U.S. of A. And then say something in the chat when the time is right. Let me make sure. Yeah, the chat thing is working. The chat picker, we are using Nightbot.tv. That's a free uh, YouTube chat website that you can use to pick random people from the chat. Um, so that's, we've got... 200 rolls, 10 rolls each, that's 20 wieners for tonight. And if we find anything silvery in your box, we will mail it to you free of charge. No purchase necessary. Void wear prohibited. All right. And we will have our, uh, our famous co-host, the Baseman64. He will be back in just a moment. But let me say hello to everybody who has said something in the chat in the past couple of minutes. We do have... Uh, let's see, 72 Brunderfly, Brenda Shank, Brian Robeson, Comic Hunter 75, Dad, who has some spare change, Dave Elmore, who is a new channel member. Thank you, Dave. Dave, at the next family reunion, we're going to need you to bring, what do we have left on the list? Oh, I know what. Uh, four bags of Walmart cheddar popcorn. It'll cost you less than 10 bucks. Uh, the kids like it, and then we can go feed the ducks afterwards, since we'll be at the uh, the park there. Then we have Ian R., Jesse Kruckenberg, Richard Cornell, Lyle Okamoto, Riley H., Table Despian Gaming, coming to us all the way from Francais, Bonjour, Mon Ami, Tom Thumb, Tata Tata, and Two Bits, John. So thank you all. Uh, if I missed your name, please say something in the chat. And I believe he is ready to make his appearance. Something in the chat. Yep, something in, oh, and also if you're a channel member at the sibling level or, a, oh, I'm sorry, the in-law level or above, then you get double the number of rolls in your hunt. We only have seven people at that level, and one of them's sitting right here, but let me bring him in, but let's give him some uh, intro music. Where oh, no. is it? Uh. Oh, hold on, I gotta go all the way. Remember, you gotta go scroll down to the middle of the thing for the. All right, here we go. Oh gosh. <laughs> and there he is, Bassman sixty four, world famous bass player. If you don't know Bassman? He's played on uh, many albums that you've never heard of, and some that you uh, <laughs> will never ever hear, but. Bass man, it's good to have you back. It's been a couple. It's been what three weeks? I think so. Yikes! But bass man, believe it or not, has a life outside of helping me. I do. Yeah, yeah, I do. Yeah. Well, I'm trying to be kind, um, but also um, let me turn on my fan. It got hot down here for some reason. I think it's because. I got the green screen behind me and it blocks all the heat from my uh, computers. But uh, yeah, Baseman does have a life. It mostly revolves around baseball and coins and golf and true. building stuff in his basement. Don't have basements in Texas. I mean, uh, garage. Sorry, garage. Yes. All right. Yes. 
Uh, Broella, welcome. Take, as, and as Joe Walsh said, I take out the dog do and hope that it's hard. Oh, yeah, that's true. That I'm an ordinary true. average guy. Uh, Chaz Man, uh, we have Richard Cornell, Gochi Sama. I think that's spelling or pronouncing that right. And did I miss anybody else? I think I got everybody. And hello to all who um, in the chat. <sighs> yeah, good to have you back, base man. Uh, he's coming to us all the way from Texas. Yep. All right, let's uh, go ahead and get things started, base man. I got the first box up here. Uh, we're doing. We started out with five rolls per winner. Went to eight. Now we're going to ten. Ten rolls will be hunted for you free of charge. If we find something silvery, we're only giving away silver. No NIFCs, no proofs, not even DDOs. We're just giving away silver. If we find something silver in your box, we'll mail it to you free of charge. Those are the rules. Pretty simple rules there, base man. Even a caveman could do it. Even I understand it. Yeah. Well, that was another reason. That's... <laughs> Ten That's holes. a simplicity test. If I can understand it, it's good. Yep. And um, again, if you're a, a sibling, no, an in-law or sibling level, you get twice as many rolls. And we only have, we've got Bo here, Richard Sapping may pop in. Baseman, of course, is at that level. Uh, the A-Bears, don't know if Kyle, Rob finds treasures at that level, but he doesn't pop in the stream that often. He did win one hunt one time. Um, and then Baseman and Timmy Tim. All right, let's get started, Baseman. And, and to honor Baseman, let's play the best 30 seconds of music around. Here we go. Bless the box with the Baseman song. Pick a wiener first. Holy cow! What am I doing, base man? What am I doing? I don't know. Let's thought pick. You'd be, thought you'd be used to picking your wiener by now. On uh, my nose, yes. But uh, hold on. What? Where that is, sounds painful. Where is it? Where's your? <laughs> gosh! <I> think it's, <laughs> I was going to say, if you no, can't find that, it's, it's gotten worse than I thought. All right. Uh, let me. Uh, oh, let me pick the first winner. Here we go. And the person that gets the first. Ten rolls is going to be Bro Ella. All right, congrats, Bro Ella. Come on, silver. Well, nothing silvery up top. What is that one there? 71. But we do have a couple new ones, so that's expected. The, uh, the mint flooded the market with half dollars over the past couple years, so nothing we can do about that. Phony Bitter, if it hold, welcome. Thank you for joining us as well. Um, all right, base man, let's get going here. Ten rolls for Bro Ella. Richard Cornell, I am about an hour north of the home of the great Bryson DeChambeau. Oh. oh, yeah. Currently, you're a master's leader at seven under par on a Thursday. Really? Seven under? Seven under, dude. I was at a conference today, sitting at the uh, booth there, watching the masters. <laughs> <laughs> Getting stuff done. There was nobody in this conference. All right, bro, Ella, here are your ten rolls, if I can show them to you without dropping them. And, Baseman, we did not find anything silver last week, so good luck us. Here we go. Let's see if we can... Tony Bitter, if it holds, love the name. Uh, no robo here. I'm the real thing. He just may seem an, uh, not animated. What do you call it? Robotic. Well, my, my intelligence is definitely artificial. Yeah. If you want to go there. Yeah. 
All right, let's go. See, I had a conference um, where I was supposed to give a talk, baseman. It was oh dear. Called a lightning talk. Oh. I only had 15 minutes, and they had it set up at. Uh, it was to be at our booth. And so you were to give a lightning talk at a booth. Yeah, it was a big booth. And um, you know that how, saying? How big was it? It was, it was uh, 20 by 8. I didn't really have a snappy comeback for that. Um, <laughs> and uh, no one showed up for it. What? Yep. Oh my gosh. I think I may be jumping the gun here. But I'm gonna go ahead and play this if I can find uh -oh. it. Actually it was it was sad, but I was glad because I didn't want to have to give the talk. I think we've got a forty for Broella right here. I didn't check the date to see if it was a 40, but that looks like a 40 right there, base man. I don't know if you can see it or not yet. I do. So let me make sure. Even though I'm out of the practice, I can see it. Wait, wait till Sergey Smirnoff, who just subscribed, and Sergey rocks. Can we get the... All right. There we go. All right, now i got to get my... Uh... 67? I don't know. I haven't I haven't checked yet, but I gotta get my. Explosion. That's my guess. Yeah, it's probably a sixty-seven because that is the best year ever for forty percent silver. Um, all right, I found the explosion. Here we go. Oh, crap, wrong side. Nineteen sixty-seven <laughs> forty percenter. Yes, indeed. All right, Broella, you are on the board with our first. Oh, you know what? Also, I gotta put the. Um, hold on, I gotta put the shorts. Are the fines? Nope, that's that's the penny fines. Hold on. Stream fines. I got to put that up right there. All right, there are the stream fines. I can update the board. We're on box one, 140. Update. Booyah! Right down there. All right, Broella, congrats. You've got something silvery in your rolls. And that's a good sign when you find silver on roll number three, Space Man. Of course, it could be a good sign that you're not going to find anything else. But it's still a well, good sign. Do you want the stress of having to go through the whole search to find something? Or you found something, now you can have nice and relax and have a fun search. And whatever happens, happens. No, it's a 77. No, I'd rather find silver. I'd rather find some silver. 61 watching. Thank you all for hanging out. I would rather find something silvery. But Sometimes I question if you would be happy doing a hunt in like 1963. <laughs> I'm not getting enough barbers. Yeah. Dang it, Jim. They're all Benjis. <laughs> Damn 63 Benjis. Roll they all number. suck. Roll number five. But, you know, I haven't... I wonder what... If you had... Say you'd go back in time and you could buy a couple of cases of that. If, or back then if you bought it and you hit it. What yeah. the inflation would be on the 50 cents each? Would it be worth it to melt it? You know what I mean? Or not melt it, but... Oh, man. Would it be worth the silver after that many years? coin with a hole in it. I'm going to say probably not. Yeah. G.O., how do you feel about coin grading services and the service that grades the service tool, CAC? No, to also CAC. Uh, Stephen Biz, greetings. Uh, oh, Stephen Biz, thank you. Um, G.O., I believe they are a necessary evil. Um it is too risky to buy what's known as raw coinages. 
the ungraded types. Um, it's rife for the pickings as far as ripoffs and like somebody could tell you that there was a value in the hole in the coin, for instance, like that. Yeah. Well, I do so, know that CAC, CAC coins fetch a bigger premium that's true. than non-CAC coins, so there has to be someone that's placing value on it, right? Yes. It may not, you know, I don't even know what they charge to get the uh, sticker. Do you know what they charge for that? I don't think uh, the sticker is meant for the uh, general. I, I don't know. It's, it's, I don't think it's for the general public. So what you can't I, you, I, you don't you can't send something to CAC. Well, you can now, but not through their uh, sticker service. It's for a regular grading. Oh. But it still carries their sticker value. Yeah. Whenever it comes back. Right. All right. Come on. Oh, let's see. One silver down, and we got one more roll for Bro Ella. Can we get one more silver for Bro Ella? Last roll. That one's got some funky on it. That's got a 2021 on the end. And that's going to be it, Bro Ella. You did get silver, though. You did get one. 40 percenter, so can't get mad at that. And our streak, we had four streams in a row with Silver Base Man, and then last week, man, those boxes were rough. And I was thinking, if Base Man is not around to hear me complain, is it really a complaint? Oh, yes. So this is the coin with the hole in it. Table Despian Gaming want to know if it was shot. I think that is... That has been tooled with a screw. What'd you call me? Or a drill. Yeah. Um, but it's it's kind of funky because the inside it's 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 like a it's not a straight hole. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, mm -hmm. it's like it's hollowed out even yeah. more. Which kind of makes you wonder how they did it. I think once they got through most of it, they stopped. All right, Broella, I need you to send me an email with your That's mailing address. That's just the address. case of most. Yeah. What's that? Nothing. Send me an email. What is today's date? Oh, yeah. Forgot. Today is my 12 plus 1 anniversary of being with my company. No, I thought you could say 13. Oh, I can't say 13 now. All right, yeah. Broella, there you go. We've got you a 40% silver half. Email me, please, with your mailing address. And remember, I do all shipments at the beginning of the month for the previous month. So this won't go out until May something. <laughs> I'm not going to say May 1st because it's not going to go out May 1st. You're welcome, Broella. Thank you for playing. All right, let's pick the next winner. Go ahead and say something in the chat. And we will pick the next winner. Richard Cornell's like, quit now so you'll have a... Positive silver stream. All right. We've got 27 eligible users. or yeah, It says users, but I guess it's contestants. The next winner is going to be Dad's Fair Change. All right, Daddy-O, you get the next 10 rolls of the box. Good luck. Whoops. Daddy, I keep knocking the rolls over. Struggling. And uh, it is time for our public service announcement real quick, base man. <laughs> this is why you should always wear your seatbelt, kids. Wait for it. Did you see that one? I did not see it. Oh. He walked away. Yes, he did. Anyway, all right. Good luck, Dad's spare change. 
It's a guy, he's on the beach, he's driving crazy, flips his SUV, and he goes up flying. Lands in the water, though. Were you, uh, you made me, maybe you weren't live. Maybe you were Memorex. Um. Good luck, Daddy O. Oh, turn on Hangman. Thank you, Sam Wilson. I wonder how many times he had to tell me to do that. All of them. Yep. Yeah. All right, give me one second. Boom, boom. All right, thank you, Sam. Hangman should be on in just a minute. All right, roll number two for Daddy O. 202. Sam. Whoops, 202 watching. Thank you all for joining me. We're giving away free half dollar hunts. You can see the half dollar rolls here to people in the chat. And we've already found silver right here for Bro Ella. We found one 40% silver half dollar. So if you want to play along or you want to have a chance to win a free 10 roll half dollar hunt, be over 18, live in the US of A, and say something in the chat for a chance to win a 10 roll. Half dollar hunt, and if we find any silver in your rolls, we will mail it to you free of charge. No purchase necessary. Void where prohibited. Dealer retains all rebates. And also, subscriptions this week are free. So hit that subscribe button before you say, nah, not tonight. We do this every Thursday night at 7.05 p.m. Eastern. And tonight we are graced with the presence of the world-famous bass player, Bassman64. <coughs> So, very honored to have him here for his wisdom and uh, jocularity. Jocularity, yeah, free silver half dollar hunts to people in the chat. I this always is, thought jocularity had to do with people wearing athletic supporters. One would think. Yeah. One would think. All right, let's keep going for Dad's Fair Change. We do have a lot of newer 2023 coins in it, but we have found silver, so we know that there's just so many of them out there, you can't avoid them anymore. You know what I mean? All right. Two Miss John wants to know if there were any cool finds in last night's nickel hunt. Uh, that would be a negative, um, <clears throat> Two Miss John. We also do, if you're just joining us, because we have 272 people watching us. We do free nickel hunts, free dollar bill hunts, and free half dollar hunts during the week. And we do it for people in the chat. You just have to be over 18, live in the U.S. of A, and say something in the chat for a chance to win a free hunt. And if we find any silver in your hunt, we will mail it to you free of charge. No purchase necessary. Void where prohibited. So, we've already got one 40 percenter on the board. Uh, Sam Wilson got a word right, and uh, Hangman went to poo. Hangman seems to do that. Hangman is our... Uh, I think the only one Sam Wilson gets... Well, the, the rankings are there, but the next game isn't there. Yeah, I've got to reset it for some stupid reason. Yeah, you, got, you can get rid of those rankings, too. You know, nobody wants to see that. I, I think Sam... Someone, the only one per person was playing last night, and it was like 15 to 1. Oh, dear. All right, DC Joe, what's up? DC Joe, welcome. DC Joe won big on Wild Pines Treasure last night. DC Joe found treasure. I right, shouldn't even check this one. It's got the ring of death, but I'm going to check it anyway. Oh, there's another one. 1974. Ah, dang it, Jim. All right, three more rolls remaining for uh, Dad's spare change. Could that be... Nope, nope, just a dirty 1980. And uh, if you just joined us, thank you for joining us. We're trying to find some more silver here in these rolls. Yep. All right, come on, come on. Because you know, I will complain if we go, if we find silver in roll three and we go the rest of the box without finding silver. I think that's a valid complaint. 
don't know about you, face man, but it's a hunt as a guarantee. I know. Last roll for Daddy O. Come on. See, I'm basically here for humor and to keep his mind right. Yes. To manage expectations. That is true. Daddy O, I did not see anything silvery in your rolls. Sorry about that, but it be what it be. All right. Thank you, Dad. 351 watching right now. Go ahead and say something in the chat if you want a chance to win a free 10 roll half dollar hunt. We're looking for silver half dollars, and if we find them in your hunt, we'll mail them to you free of charge. Free of charge. And uh, go ahead and hit the subscribe button, turn the notifications bell on, and then join us. Well, next week, I won't have a stream on Tuesday or Wednesday because I've, I've got to travel. got to go to Virginia. Yuck. No, not the state of Virginia is yucky. Traveling is yucky. But we will be back next Thursday night with another free silver half dollar hunt. And subscribe, sub subscribe, subscriptions this week are free of charge. So go ahead and hit that subscribe button. All right, let's pick the next wiener, and it's going to be Jesse Kruckenberg. All right, Jesse, come on. Let's turn this around with something silvery. Yep, got a Got to fly out on Tuesday morning for a Wednesday presentation, and then I'm flying back Wednesday or Tuesday night. And uh, it's going to be a waste of my time. That's one way to be positive. Colin is asking, is this an old gentleman's type game, or do 20-year-olds watch this too? Um, coin collecting is typically an old man's game, but we welcome all ages. As long as you're over 18, or 18 or over. All right, good luck. Who are we doing again? Good luck, Jesse. Here we go. <laughs> All right, Jesse, come on. Let's see what we can find. All right, so if you don't know, Baseman was, uh, is gainfully unemployed at this moment. How have you been spending your days, Baseman? Besides, ah. besides sleeping till 11. Well, one day it was 2 in the afternoon. Oh, really? Yeah. And then the next day it was uh, one thirty in the morning, followed by 3.30 in the morning. Jeez. And I'm just now getting over the sick. You know, you were sick? Yep. Oh, that stinks. Did we have, um, was I around for medical procedure talk? Um, no, you were not. Uh -huh. well, we do have a DDO here, 1974 DDO. That is what that is. Let me show it to you. Um, right there, 1974 DDO. Uh, David, I guess. David or Davey? Dave? David, I think that's David. right. David Volturi, what am I looking at? I can't see into your, uh, into your house, David. You probably, Actually, you can, but you're probably on. I'll let you know that yeah, you can. Probably on a phone, maybe. Oh, you're looking at us. Okay, we're hunting half dollars, looking for silver half dollars. That's why I'm here. Yep. All right, roll number three. Come on, Jesse. Let's find something silvery. Uh oh. We have to stop talking about her now that she's here. Who's here? Scooter the craftiest. B? Oh, the crafty's here. And Scooter B, welcome. What is he? What is, uh, Scooter B said, hello, everyone. You had me at hello. Yeah, you did, Scooter B. <laughs> That's one of the new five, five sounds we put up there. All right, let's keep going, looking for something silvery for Jesse. Geo, I started at 11. It's not an old man's game. I was going to coin, coin shows by 14. It is typically an old man's game. Yes. But there are a lot of young people in the, uh, in the hobby. It's a good way to make a little extra money, especially if you... Aren't old enough to work. 
just go grab you a box of coins and hunt through them and find something sweet and sell it on uh, eBay. All right, five more walls left. John Jacobs, welcome. He says, hello, Cornelius. <laughs> John Jacobs, greetings to thee. Come on, silver. So, um, I don't want to get too graphic or anything here. But oh, yeah, you had a procedure. You, uh, I think you were aware, and I'll tell the chat, because there's only 247 of my closest friends there. Yeah. That, uh... Um, I had an 8-inch cyst next to my right kidney. And it felt a little, I mean, it really didn't feel like much, but you could kind of tell it was there. You're talking about the cyst. <laughs> yes, and the kidney. Yes. <laughs> Go ahead. So, um... I was like, uh, could, could we, could we remove this? And they were like, no, but we could drain it. I was like, oh, let's do that. So on the 29th, I think of March, they drained it. Two and a half liters of fluid. Oh my gosh. Two and a half liters. Yes. They were stunned. And I'm, and and I was as I was waking up, and boy, was that some good sleep! Woo. Oh, I bet. And uh, they were like, "Dude, two and a half liters." I'm, I'm telling them, "Why do you think I wanted to come here? I'm gonna waste your time for like a, a millimeter or you, a milliliter." Did you get to keep any of the uh, fluid? Put it like no, it was uh, amber colored, and uh, I was going to start a brewery, but yeah. they advised against it. Yeah, probably not a good idea. And uh, they tested it, but I don't think um, it was very smart, so it probably failed. Yeah. And uh, I don't know. <laughs> Last roll for Jesse, and also uh, somebody just subscribed. Where did it go? Derek Hammer just subscribed. Thank you, Derek. We appreciate it. I think that's 72 just... Brundle fly. That fluid goes for big bucks on eBay. <laughs> you should have kept I spoke it. Pro... Did they taste it? Uh, Richard, they didn't admit to it. Yeah, they never do. They never admit it. You know they're back there doing shots. Oh my gosh, yes. All right. Well, Jesse, brother, nothing silvery there. Let's check this for a DDO. Negatron. But. Thank you for playing along, Jesse and John Bryan. Welcome. And Jimmy J, welcome as well. So 248 watching. If you just joined us, we're giving away free half-dollar hunts to people in the chat. You just have to be over 18, well, 18 or over. Live in the U.S. of A, because I'm not shipping overseas, and say something in the chat. So go ahead and say something in the chat, and we will pick the next wiener for the next 10 rolls. And if we find something silvery in your hunt we will mail it to you free of charge and also yes good mess or good uh, point uh toby subscribe now because it is free this week free subscriptions this week whoops trying to show what toby was saying and then I messed up my chat here joe woodman welcome all right let's pick the next wiener and it's going to be roll it tom thumb all right tom good luck you get the next 10 rolls on the price. Oh, wait, wrong wrong show. <laughs> on the price is free. Did I see Pa's spare time? You did see Pa's spare time. Sweet. Yeah, welcome, Pa. Thank you for joining us. Pa had a, a dollar hunt earlier today. And if you don't know Pa's spare time, go check out Pa's spare time. He does a bunch of streams as well. I'll put a, uh, his link on the uh, chitty chat there. And then let me do one thing real quick. I forgot to fix this last time. Let's see if I can fix it real quick before things get out of hand. Where is it? Where is it? Here it is. And we got it over here. So. 
How much did two and a half liters of cyst fluid weigh? Well, when I came home, I lost five pounds. That's it? Yeah. I would think it'd be a lot more than that. I was happy with that. Well, of course. Yeah, but that's the uh, uh, liters to uh, pounds trend, or what? I don't want to say translation, but... Uh, Conversion? <laughs> Conversion, right? Uh, not all stories can be good. That is Sorry. True. But Did we... I tell you the part about me being recently unemployed, Pa? Yeah. How's right. that for a uh, follow-up? Good luck, Tom Thumb. Here we go. Come on. We need some more silver out of this box here. 198 watching. Sorry for the delay. I had to fix a sound that was not correct. And it, the sounds are so important to this show. If you don't have the correct sound, it just doesn't quite, doesn't quite do it. You know what I mean, bass man? Oh, yeah. So we can... All right. Roll number two for Tom Thumb. Yeah. <sighs> nope. Just... Oh, you almost had it. You could be quicker than that. Two and a half liters. That is crazy talk. Did you have kidney stones? No. Just wow. developed over time. When do they expect they're going to have to drain it again? Well, that is a chance. And, um, but I don't know how long it took for this to develop. Yeah. So it could be years in the making. Eight fingers crossed and two thumbs up. All right, come on. We need one more silver here. We want more than that. We do have three other boxes, though, to go through. And... Oops. And I just dropped a coin. Can I get it to it? Yeah. Only if there's a printer nearby. Yeah. I almost got it. For the uh, chat, there was once an instance where Southern Metal was hunting the coinages and he uh, dropped one and couldn't find it and he later found it in a printer. Silent breed is people! You found it, huh? Well, you did in your printer. No, Silent Green is people. Did you play that? Oh. Did you play I that? I did. Oh, it just, it just played itself. Uh-oh. Maybe I may have touched the screen with my uh, elbow yes. or something. Huh? All right, come what? on, Tom Thumb. Soil green is people. You are correct. All right, let's keep going here. You know, we hunted nickels last night, found absolutely nothing. $100 bills on Tuesday night. Didn't really find much. We kind of... Found a couple of notes that we stretched a little bit so, to say they were fancy. But that, like you said, it's called coin roll hunting and not coin roll finding. Thank, Thank you, Pop. Have a great night. BMC, howdy. Emil, greetings to the good sir. Yes, I welcome, am, Emil. I am... Uh, by my estimation, it is about 10 minutes till cold coffee time. Yeah, come on, man. Crafty Dragon, that might be right. The coin was found due to the printer malfunction. Yeah, I couldn't, my printer wouldn't work, and I'm like, what the heck? So I took it all apart, and there was the half dollar. It went into the uh, manual feed slot, where you manually feed paper in. All right, two more rolls left for... Tom Thumb, so go ahead and say something in the chat for a chance to win a free 10 roll hunt. So I've already got silver, but. And we have three more boxes, so maybe. I don't know which one is the sister box, so. Uh, I had to. I picked them up this morning before I went to my uh, 
my conference, and I don't, I don't remember which was which. All right. Sorry, Tom Thumb. Nothing silvery there. Nothing silvery. But we tried. Sherry, welcome. Glad you're here. Sherry. Uh, Pav saw Wiki. Why do I keep checking the, the dates? You're looking for something called a doubled die. And uh, on the Kennedy half dollars, for the ones we're looking at, they are in the early 70s, 71 through 77, with the exceptions of no 75 or 76. Um, so that's what I keep doing. I keep checking the dates to see if it is a double die. Jefferson Bacon, welcome. All right, let's pick the next winner. 240 people watching. Thank you all for hanging out with me and the one and only Baseman64. So we've got 31 eligible contestants here. And then Sabrina Malcolm just described, and Sabrina took advantage of our free subscription week. Doesn't cost anything to subscribe this week only. Thank you. Sabrina. All right, here we go. The next winner is going to be Jefferson Bacon. Comes in late. Boom, he wins. Good luck, Jefferson Bacon. Let's see what we can find here in the rolls. Yeah, so I got up really early so I could be at my bank when they open. And then I went down to the other bank on the way to the conference. Picked up those rolls and uh, had them in the back of my car, hidden under some cardboard, because I had to park. And uh, it was a pretty safe area, but still, you know. And I was very happy when I went out and my back of my uh, window was not busted out. <laughs> That's always a good thing. Yeah. Always a good thing. Jeff Cotton, let me see if I can help you out. Oh, wait. No. Oh. Oh. You gotta scroll down more. Oh. No, no, you gotta scroll down. For some reason, the top part of the of the uh, iPad doesn't oh. do the video. Weird. Yeah. So if you scroll down, it's gonna be. Ah, oh, I got you. Got it. All right, let's keep going for, uh, what are we doing again? Jefferson Bacon, sorry. Oh. Is anybody going to die? Somebody's got to go back and get exploded. I love that. All right, come on, Jefferson Bacon. Last 10 rolls of the box. Christopher, with a K, just subscribed, and Christopher, with a K, rocks. Thank you, Christopher. We appreciate it. Oh, you almost had it. It's every quicker than that. We might do our dollar bill hunt on Monday night if I can get a thousand one dollar bills. So be sure to click that subscribe button and turn the notifications bell on and join us on Monday night for... Free dollar bill hunts. I ain't falling for no banana in my tailpipe. Oh, and by the way, I did see this. You did see what? Mateo Donato. Mateo Donato. Yes. All right, roll number six for Jefferson Jefferson Bacon. Andres Restrepo. I probably butchered that. Just subscribe. And they rock. Thank you very much. We appreciate it. Yep, subscriptions are free this week. Limited time only. No purchase necessary. Whoop, whoop, whoop. Come on. Come on, 73 DDO. Negatron. All right. Four more rolls. And then we've got three more boxes to do or to hunt. So be sure to say something in the chat and be over 18 and live in the USA. Sorry, Table Despian Gaming. We've got a new channel member, Baseman, that's from France, or he's in France. I don't know if he's from France, but he's definitely in France. And uh, I told him it's going to be maybe tough for him to get over here for our next family reunion. But um, 
<laughs> Dang it, Jim, he says. Oh. Uh, table dance spin. Um, do you play uh, PlayStation or Xbox? You have, to, you have to say it in French. Oh, he's not. Uh, Voulez, playez. Uh, <laughs> uh, you uh, love the name. Not going to say it. All right, come on. Come on, Jefferson Bacon. I don't remember Buck Shot. I do remember his uh, cousin, Buck Naked. All right. Nothing there. Last roll of the box for Jefferson Bacon. It's going to be a one silver box, I am afraid. Yep, one silver only in that box. But, hey, we found silver. So, we'll complain for at least another box and a half. Maybe. Maybe two boxes. Sorry, uh, Jefferson Bacon, nothing silvery there. So let's go ahead and get the next box up here on the table, and we will get started. Who chose this box? We've only found 140 so far, 140% silver for Bro Ella. But that's still better than nothing. Better than poking the eye with a blunt stick. That's true. All right, there we go. Let's go ahead and bless the box with the pizza rolls. Sassy the big beard, beardy, is it beardy? Yeah. Announce, I don't, announce doesn't work here, but that would be kind of cool to do that. But thank you very much for joining us. John Bryan says, does this work? I can't see what you're holding up, John. Hold it closer to the camera. Oh, no. All right, let's pick the next wiener, and it's going to be... Kennedy! <laughs> Kennedy! Sam, the college man, Wilson. All right, oh, Sam. Oh, boy. Here we go. Let's see if we've got anything silvery on top here for Sammy Sam Sam. And uh, nothing silvery. We got some more newer coins. Here's a uh, dirty coin, but nothing, nothing silvery there. That's all right. We'll hunt it anyway. I think that's the purpose of the show, right? Hunt it anyway. Oops. All right. Stay, Stay on, on target. target. Stay, Stay on, on target. target. <laughs> Good luck, Sam Wilson. You know, base man, it will be Sam the Engineer Wilson in 30 days. Who chose this box? Sam the Engineer Wilson. Interesting. It doesn't have the same ring to it, though. No. Oh, you know what? It could be Sam College Alumni Wilson. Ooh. I like that better. Yes. I like that better. Nothing silvery down there. All right, good luck. Sammy Sam, here we go. Let's see if we can find something silvery for Sam, the college man, Wilson. Now, this box has a lot more newer coins in it, but we have found silver and newer coins, or boxes with newer coins. And uh, Rob Fine Treasure had a box the other day with a bunch of newer coins, and he found a bunch of silver as well. Oh, I forgot to change my... Bucket, hold on one second. Ugh. Let me grab a couple half dollars. There we go. I think you know what the problem is just as well as I do. I do. I had a little bit too much alcohol that night. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Oh, yeah. All right. Oh, dang it, Sam. Lots of new coins in this box. But that's all right. I-72 there. Could this be a DDO? Negatron. All right, lucky sippy sip. Thank you, Emil. Yeah, 
Yep. Gotta find something silvery. That's the name of the game. So any any luck on the uh, job yes, search? I for silver for so long. You know. Or you just don't care right now. Um, I do care, but um, one of the things about getting sick is that I haven't been upstairs here, like grinding on the computer, um, following up on um, applications and looking for more stuff. Right. So I. My concern has been kept to a minimum. Yeah, I understand. I understand that. Cody Juan Kenobi, welcome. Wow. Lots of new coins in this one here. Well, GAO, I mean, it takes a long time when you first get started. But... If you're Southern Metal, you get your your speed improves, but if you're me, it doesn't. <laughs> so, I mean, I started off at the bottom, and after a long time, I stayed at the bottom and continue at the bottom. So, you just got to do Chinese algebra in your head. Oh wait, what's he talking about? I don't know. Oh, hunting rolls quickly. I thought he was talking about something else. Oh. <laughs> All right. Come on, Sam, the college man. He's like, well, I'm not doing anything. You're the one hunting the coins. And dang it, Jim. That's all right. After a lot of hard work and dedication, we're still at the bottom. That's right. right. Reese Shero, what do I do? Well, about what? Um, do you have an issue? Uh, this isn't uh, Dr. Drew uh, necessarily. Uh, we, we're just um, failing in an attempt to provide a little bit of uh, education and humor. I believe the word is infotainment. No, I think, I think they're asking what they do for a living. What do oh. I do? Uh, oh. I'm going to guess that you're a uh, veterinarian. Hmm. Greg has a good question. What do I do with the coins that are not silver? I bury them in my yard. No, I just put them in bank bags and redeposit them at a different bank from where I got the coins. And... It's about 30 minutes away, so I'm expecting that I'll never see these coins again, but you do. Sam Wilson, sorry, brother. Nothing silvery in your rolls. If you want to participate, go ahead and say something in the chat. Be over 18 and live in the U.S. of A. Ah, Reese. Jeremy Foster, greetings. Free half-dollar silver. It's free half-dollar silver hunts. The hunt is the most important part. We're just giving away 10 rolls per hunt to people in the chat. So if you're over 18 and, you, and you, you live in the U.S. of A. and you just said something in the chat, you're eligible to win. Landscaper Life, you're working way too hard at this. Oh, Landscaper Life, welcome to the stream. All right, let's pick the next winner, and it's going to be Sherry4672. All right, Sherry, good luck. You got the next 10 rolls on the price is free. The price is free. Yeah, something like that. All I right. like it. Good luck, Sherry. Let's see if we can find anything silvery. So, base fan, my uh, Coinstar video is still going fairly strong. It's crazy. Two and a half. 2.8 million views. <laughs> and I'm almost ready for my next Epic Coinstar video, which will be, Can We Fill Up the Coinstar? That will be the title oh of the next video. 
I am close to having 500 pounds of pennies. Greg Siebold, how many rolls do you open during a show? Well, there are, if I remember right, there are 50 rolls in a box, and he does four boxes. So, take your time that would be 200 Thanks. rolls, I think, right? Yeah, 200 rolls per stream. And everybody that wins. Well, the, that's half dollars. 200 rolls? What do you mean? First, what? Half dollar rolls. Yeah, right? 200 half dollar rolls, yes. Yeah. yeah. Uh, when we do nickels, I usually only get one box of nickels a week, so we only do 50 rolls there. Um, so, yes, we do. And. I usually have four boxes of half dollars, but there are rare occasions where I only am able to pick up two boxes, so we do two boxes. Come on, Sherry. And we just have Greg Seibold, or is it Seibold? Or is it Seibold? Greg just subscribed, and Greg rocks. Thank you, Greg. We do appreciate it. Let's. Come on, man, there's just so many brand new, and they're a mix too, 2023s, 2021s, so you know these have been through the, uh, the coin sorter as well. No, wait a minute. Dime boxes are 350 right? No, 250 Dime bags are 350 <laughs> Not touching it. You're just going to sit back, roll back. You're not, you're not touching it? Nope. Don't I know how you know that? <laughs> I know, I said, you're not touching it, and then... That's what she said. said. <laughs> <laughs> See, he says he needs me for this. I do. But there are times when he shines on his home. Only because you're not here. Uh, Hugh, uh, the last year they minted silver half dollars for circulation. Was Six some of the metal's favorite year. 1969. No, they did, did make some in 1970, but they were only for collectors. Yep. Three rolls remaining for Sherry. Come on, Sherry, bring us home here. Man, someone wanted this. Guess what? I got a fever. And the only prescription is for cowboy. Dang it. Dang it, Jim. Now, Hugh, uh... 64 and before are 90% silver and... So the metal's favorite year um, are forty three percent. You it depends on uh, condition and how much silver it has. Yep, so I should bring some up here just to show you. Silver's gone away. I got some right here if you want. <laughs> Actually, I've got a picture. Hold on a second. Where did it go? Uh, this is a Kennedy half dollar. That's sorry. What you saying? Kennedy half dollar. Oh, it, no, it, it no, goes, that's not what you said. It's going away. There's a Ben Franklin half dollar. It goes away after a second or two, and then a Walking Liberty half dollar. So that's what we're looking for right there. Oh, and I, you know what? I almost forgot to remind people about this. Let me just put this up real quick. So you guys can take a, you can just read it for yourself. It's just more of a public service announcement saying, I'll take it off when I'm done with this roll here. Just to remind everybody, you must not be live. Are you saw, Unbelievable. He, he saw it. All right. <laughs> Sorry, Sherry, nothing in your rolls there. Nothing in your rolls. He'll, he'll stop doing this eventually. I think I have an about an approximation as to when that might be. Yeah. It's been 84 years. Yeah. 
All right, let's pick the next winner. Here we go. And it's Baseman 64. Oh, my gosh. Here we go. Baseman gets 20 rolls. 20 rolls because he is a... So telling me there's a chance. <laughs> yeah! <laughs> Rick and Tony. Oh, my gosh. If you're at the uh, sibling... Or in-law level, you get double the free rolls. Still, no purchase necessary to play. We've had a lot of people that aren't even channel members win tonight, and that's void wear prohibited. Void wear prohibited. Uh, DJ Super Fly Guy, we have found British pennies in half dollar rolls before. Yes, we're not. That's not what we're after, though. We're after silver half dollars. So many rolls up here. I got to move the paper. Sam Wilson, I actually hope not. Thank you, two bits, John. Yeah. What does Sam say? He's going to silver ender. I don't know. This is baseman is actually taking one for the team here because there are a lot of newer coins in these rolls. So, in essence, he's helping us get rid of these bad rolls so that we can get to the better roll for which he will be. Ineligible. It's good to be. Thank you, so, Brian V. Howdy, Brian. Welcome. Thank you for joining us. All right, come on. We actually know how to say his last name. It's just like a quasi entertaining running bit. Yeah, it is a running bit. Find something that works. You stick with it. That's right. This is the one that is suspect. I don't think it's silver. It's just. It's just. Green, dirty, yeah, it's not, it's not silver. It's a dirty 77. You could almost call that nasty. Really? <laughs> yep. That was just a setup for the sound. All right. Hey, Sam. Oh, Jeremy Foster, thank you. It's nice to be seen, I think. Yeah. Baseman is even better if you only hear him. Wow, look at all these new coins, Baseman. Holy cow. I don't even need to flip them over because I know they're all going to be new. Hugh, it actually is, yes. Yep. A uh, box of half dollars is $500 worth. So if you go to your bank and order a box, do not ask them for less than a box. They will not like you, and they will probably tell you that they can't order it. So you ask them, can you order me a box of half dollars? Be sure you tell them that they will never see these half dollars again. Say, I will not bring them back to you. Then they will be more than willing to order them for you. Would they? Oh, no. <laughs> you, you didn't. Uh, hold on. You didn't. Hold on. I can get the sound to play. Right here. Right here in the middle of all these brand new coins, we've got silver. Gosh. So anyone who was happy to see me at the beginning of the stream, how happy are you now? <laughs> well, it's only a 40. Because I had to look at it. I'm like, is that, could that, what? See, see, Mateo? <laughs> and it's going to be... Hold on, i got to get the uh, oh. sound ready, or the explosion ready. Again. 19 is 67. 40 percenter for the base man. Best year ever for 40% silver half dollars. You know what? I forgot to check for uh, DDO. Oh, oh my gosh. That was not it. Well, basically, we got you something silvery. I'll put that in your envelope and mail it to you in about a year or so. Yeah, yeah. Thank you, Scooter B. Hey, that's good, though. That means we've got two boxes Yes, we got rid of all those new coins. Yeah. Cody Jones, a 1964 half dollar. It's worth about $10. Now, silver has gone up. And I don't think I told you this, did I? That I sold a boatload of silver all over the weekend. Really? A boatload. $1,200 face. 
face. Yes. <laughs> Good Lord. Yep. I had to cash in while the cashing in was cash or cash. What? Uh, I had to oh, zoom me out. Thank you, Emil. Yeah, 1029 on Coinflation. Um, but you know the the deal is with silver being so high, the premiums are not here yet. You need silver to be at a high dollar amount for an extended period of time because a lot of dealers they don't want to buy your silver and then have silver crash the next day. Oh yeah. And then they're stuck with it. So I barely got melt essentially for it. But I still made money. I still it's almost like money. a game of hot potato. Yeah. They probably only buy it if they have someone to sell it to. Well that was why that was my suit my, my silver dealer knew I had this much to sell and he called me and says, Are you ready to sell? And he gave me the price. And he said, all right, let me call and make sure I've got a buyer first. And he did. He found a buyer. And so I went down there and we counted up a bunch of silver. He's got a coin counting machine. And boom, there we go. Uh, Jeremy, it was about in that range. Yes. All right. Ten rolls left for the base, man. My manure greetings to thee, good sir. Oh, yeah. Welcome. Thank you for joining us. But that was on Saturday when silver was not as high. I mean, it's at 28 something right now. I think it was, a, I can't remember what it was. But yeah, that was from the collection I bought last July. And the only reason I sold it was silver went up, and I'm thinking it's going to go back down. And it has not. Look at all these. Look at that. All that and bicentennial in the middle. All right, eight more rolls left for the base man. Thank you all for joining us. Don't forget, hit that subscribe button. Turn the notifications bell on and join us. Probably Monday night we'll do free dollar bill hunts. And Lord Salad Bar, that's a great name. Just subscribe and Lord Salad Bar rocks. Sort of. Again, another 1967. 40 per silver. 40, 40 per 40 silver. 40 per silver. <laughs> 40 percent. That was, uh, oh gosh. Look, that was, uh, 20. Yeah. 14. Was, yeah. 2018. 2018. Yeah, the camera, the, uh, the, the, the uh, we'll need that. clock's a little. Uh, Scott H., uh, there's a running joke in the chat. First, that the whole system is rigged because I get selected for this stuff. And then, that I, during his hunt for me, he finds silver. I would much rather him not find anything for me or even be selected, but he insists. Now, Baseman, he has contributed hundreds of hours to help me co-host a stream and uh i mean i give him some stuff every now and then but i haven't given him anything in a while so i feel bad it's <laughs> it's peter griffin you know i don't you know what really grinds my gears probably not very good is it it sounded more like lois with a head cold yeah but hey, we found, like, I'm amazed we found silver in this box, to be honest, because it's got so many brand new ones here. I mean, look at that. That whole roll is almost all brand See, new. See, they're, they're not focusing all the new ones that we're eliminating. 
Yeah. Like, look at that. Right? Yeah, that was only three. That's, that's doing my duty right there. Only three of that whole roll was uh, not brand new ones. All right, come on. That's all right. We got plenty of rolls to go around. He wins once in a blue moon. Was that another one? See, it has nothing to do with me. I mean, I'm just... That's just damage. Yeah. I'm just the... I'm just the uh, what? The life entertainment. It, it's all due to... I know Southern, Southern Metal's pretty, pretty good, good at, at stuff. stuff. See? That's what it's all about right there. All right. I'm doing it too fast. That's... The, Hold on. Oh, uh, wait, wait. <laughs> it's a race. <laughs> That's what <Yep>. she said. <laughs> That's what she said. Yeah. We've hunted. I know that we've not hunted as many half dollars as, say, Rob, who finds the treasure, or Pa's spare time. But we've hunted about a million and a half half dollars. So, after a while, you get pretty good at running through the rolls here. Last roll for the base man and nothing silvery. We've only got just a couple that aren't silver in here. Or no, I mean aren't moves. Alright base man, we got two forties for you. Can't get mad at that. Unbelievable. This may prompt me to actually I don't think I have anything else here for you though, don't I think I sent all my stuff to you. I think so. Yeah. All right, baseman, congrats. Thank you. 267's there. Put that right over there. All right, we got 10 rolls left in this box. We might have more silver. You never can tell. So sure. go ahead and say something in the chat, and we will pick the next wiener. Yep, baseman, it is well deserved. <sighs> Very much so. All right, the next winner is going to be Cappadocius. Cappadocius, ah, yes. new winner. So good luck, Cappadocius. He gets the next, or she, or it, they, something like that. They get the next 10 rolls. Cody Jones, yes, there are a lot of half dollars worth a lot of money. Some that you could find in a roll would be the 1938 out of Denver, Walking Liberty half dollar. There's a baseman dancing. Yeah, that's me reacting to my 240s. Oh, that was your reaction? <laughs> uh, yeah, there's a lot. If you go to our website at southernmetal.net, click on the mintages and for the different half dollars, and I have the key dates uh, up there listed out. Um, all right, who we, we're doing Kappa. Docius, good luck, yes. Kappa. I gotta get these rolls out of the way. Give me a little room here. Oh, come on, silver. But that does show, baseman. You can have a roll or have a box with a bunch of a bunch of new rolls. That's right. And yes, still find silver. Herbal turtles. It doesn't matter that you're late. What matters is that you're here. Yep. That's a really nice 74. That would have been a really sweet DDO there. And Dave Elmore, that is actually not me dancing. Um, no. That's... I'm the one up on stage playing as opposed to being on the floor dancing. You, if you want to see Baseman dance, go to his OnlyFans page. No, it's an OnlyFans page. No, I quit subscribing, so really it's... <laughs> you have no more fans on your OnlyFans page. Mm. Yes. Need a fan. Roll number three for Kappa. I'm just going to say Kappa because I don't even know if I'm pronouncing that last part correctly. Docious? I think so. Sherry, I don't really think that was you. Sure. Oh. Richard, oh, you're killing me. No, but I, I 
I am familiar with the song. All right, come on. Come on, Kappa. Right. Turtle Turtles? No, no, no. No one's won anything. Don't worry about that. Especially a co-host. If anyone tells you the co-host has won a couple of 40% silvers, pay no attention. Yeah, yeah. No. Oh, let me update the board. Uh, We're on box two, right? Yeah. All right. Oh, man, look at that. Almost a brand new roll. 91, 89. And a 83. So I just dropped it. Let me grab that, take a sip. Richard, do you believe that when I first started playing, that was one of the two bands I learned to play against or to play with? Because I was didn't know any better. I didn't know how hard it was. So I was like, yeah, I can do this. And then everything else was like, Okay. Well, Ben, air supply. Air supply. I'm all, I'm all out of love. Yeah. That's what he says. He, he sends me a text like 10 minutes before um, go time. And he says he's all out of love and he can't live without me. No, I'm so lost without That's me. why he knows about air supply. Oh, yeah. No, my joke is whenever I go to a wedding and they have a DJ, I always ask them to play some air supply. <laughs> and sometimes they'll do it. I'm like, what song? It doesn't matter. The groom really likes air supply. And he's like, oh, gotcha, gotcha. Oh. Yeah, it was during your uh, wedding, right? No, we did not have a band at my wedding. We had a... Uh, Guy holding up a boombox. With air supply. That was mostly John Denver. I only had, <laughs> I only had, I only had one eight track back then. So. Oh, oh man, and it would stop at those critical moments, and then you would just have to. Yeah. Imagine what it sounded like, and then it would pick up. Can you fast forward to the next song? No, I can't do that. It's an eight track. All right, come on, Kappa. Last roll. Pound foolish. We have found. Uh, silver in every box so far, but we're only at 340s. <coughs> Excuse me. Lucky Sippy Sip. Jefferson Bacon, back in my younger days, I played Weddings and Conceptions. Yeah. That's good money. Yeah, you game. know, we made the same amount of money in the 80s as we did, as we do today. Wow. Yeah, you'd have that uh, concert outside the Red Carpet Inn. Oh, yeah. For conceptions. Oh, yeah. Scott, Scott H., not, no tater juice yet. I'm this stupid without tater juice. All right, let's go to box number three and pick the next wiener. Go ahead and say something in the chat. I'm going to change gloves. After a while, these gloves are uh, Stephen Biz inside, if you know what I'm saying. No, dear. Moist. Quite moist. Mm-hmm. Yeah, Wes, that's my southern accent. We're picking the next wiener. It's okay. just one wiener after another for southern metal. Yep. All right. Cool King, welcome. Thank you for joining us. Andrew Galupi, welcome. Rooftop Randy. And Greg Sabold, Fender. Ooh. My brother has a Fender. You have a Fender bass? I have two or three. Two or three. He's old. He can't remember. <laughs> fair. That's fair. I mean, yeah. Well, it's a 73 uh, precision, which sounds wonderful. We need some stick songs. <laughs> That's great. Who's no, the I can throw one up hands. on the uh, channel. No, no, that'd get a strike. Not this Who's the channel. one who poops in their pants? All right, hold on. Who's the one who poops in their pants? <laughs> well, 
Wait for it. Wait for it. All right, let me grab some more gloves. We got some new gloves here, which I hate using new gloves because they're so slippery. Uh, pound foolish, have I been taking all the good coins near Blue Ridge? I have not been up, if you're talking about Blue Ridge, Georgia, I've not been up to Blue Ridge in a long time. Bro, I was like, don't play any ABBA or I'm out of here. Richard Cornell, I do not believe that to be the case because Eric might be Alex's brother, but he's not part of the band. And there is no weak link in the rush. No. Hush, your, hush yourself. All right, everybody who, everybody who wants to participate, I'm assuming it said something in the chat and you're over 18 and you live in the U.S. of A. So let's pick the next wiener and it's going to be Mamunarashi. Abba puts me to sleep. All right. Monsieur Rashid, here we go. Oh, I gotta bless it with something. Let's just do the uh we haven't done this one in a while. Let's do the if I can find it. Silver song. There we go. Alright, good luck. Rooftop Randy says do his rolls extra fast. I'm trying to do all the rolls extra fast. Good luck. Here we go, come on, silver enders, and nothing silver. We've got more new rolls, or new coins, which is expected. I think it's going to be tough in the next several years, base man, to get rolls that aren't, that or get boxes without a lot of new rolls, or new coins, whatever I'm trying to say. <laughs> well, all of your boxes will have new rolls. That's what I'm, that's, that's, that stands to reason. Because if they're not new, then they're customer rolled and, well, wouldn't be in a box. Yeah. You keep using the four. I don't think it means what you think it means. Yeah, I don't think it does either. All right. <laughs> Ten rolls. Hold on. Let me get another sheet of Southern Metal coin roll hunting paper available exclusively on Amazon. Ten rolls. Ridiculous. Ridiculous. It is ridiculous. All right, good luck. First time wiener, I think. I know he's been in the chat quite a bit, or maybe I'm wrong. He'll probably correct me if I'm incorrect. All right, good luck. Here we go. Ten rolls, box numero three o. Let's find something silvery. Oh, second time. All right. Well, good luck. DDO, Negatron, all right, adjust the camera here, all right, actually, I don't even know if you've seen that, that uh, if you've been here for the HAL editions, the HAL sounds, were you here for those? The HAL sounds. HAL. I'm, I'm sorry, sorry Dave. Dave, I'm, I'm afraid, afraid I, I can't, can't do that. that. Oh, there we go. Yeah. All right, good luck. Come on, silver. Let's find. And there, there are the edges. <laughs> I haven't played that one in a while. Probably get a copyright strike from Silver Seeker. <laughs> Roll number three. Richard Cornell, that would be a pretty strong show. That's just a dirty 71. Richard Sappington, welcome. Thank you for joining us. Come on, Silver. We haven't had a good monster box in a while. I was thinking with tax season, people would be uh, dumping the silver, but not yet. So, uh, Mama Noor, how many uh, silver coins would you like? I'm going to go ahead and take a guess. <laughs> oh, good times. JC likes Pam. Greetings to thee. JC, welcome. 
All right, come on. Well, there's less new oh. coins in these rolls, but there's still some new ones. I was wrong with my guess. He only wants one. Oh, okay. See, that's I like that guess. Yeah, the pressure's off. I, I like his uh, response. Yeah, he's not greedy. No. Just give me one uh, seed of liberty. Ah. Is that dirty or is that... Yeah, dang it, it's a dirty 74 out of Philadelphia. Come on, silver. Dang it, Jim. Last four rolls, and then we'll pick the next wiener so you can... <laughs> Yeah, Richard Cornell, I was just going to let you uh, uh, soak in that one. All right. Three rolls remaining. Oh, oh. I'm trying to get this box. So oh. you, you played something the same time I played something. I didn't play anything. Oh, really? Oh, someone did redeem who? Mate yeah. Mateo did. All right, I'll have to play mine again. I'm just it. All right, come on. Two more rolls remaining. And we still have another box after this. I'm trying to do it so Base Man doesn't fall asleep. But I did notice he had an energy drink. Uh, Richard uh, Cornell, it's better for you to soak in your Depends than to soak in my Depends. Well, it all depends. I had a great dad joke earlier today. All right. What happened to it? I'm going to tell it. Last roll. Sorry if we don't find anything silvery. We have these little stickers. When you go to these uh, tech coins or trade shows, they always have little stickers. Oh, yes. And so someone pointed to one and said... Would you like one of these? And I said, I can't. I'm allergic to adhesive. They go, really? I go, yes, it's a sticky situation. <laughs> He's playing crickets. You had your you had your finger on that crickets button <laughs> waiting for me to say something like that, didn't you? I was hovering for the last two minutes. Sorry about that. Mr. Rashid, nothing silvery in your rolls, but thank you for playing a long. Go ahead and say something in the chat, and we will pick the next wiener. While I take a sippy sip, sad trombone sound. Indeed. I need to get uh, my son to play that. No, he plays the, uh, yeah, so trombone's the one that slides, right? That's what, never mind. Mm -hmm. Yes. Yeah. Mellow the Jello, it's not up to me, but if it was, sure. All right, the next winner is going to be Scooter B. Congrats, Scooter B. She said hello earlier. You had me at hello. You certainly did, Scooter B. Good luck. Here we go. Ten rolls for the Scooteroni. Wait a minute. You said Scooter got it? Yeah. Scooter B. What in the wide, wide world of sports is going on here? Oh, man. Oh, man. Oh, man. Oh, man. Eddie Esco just subscribed and Eddie Esco rocks. Anything silvery down there? Nothing silvery. All right. And East Tennessee Trucks just subscribed and they rock. In fact, they are much rockier. No, that doesn't make sense. What? They rock harder than West Tennessee trucks. That West Tennessee truck guy, he's a loser. All right, good luck, Scooter B. Here we go. Can't believe no one is getting this hangman or base man. Come on, Scooteroni. And I really do, uh, even though it's not a strategy, hope that Scooter is a uh, nickname. That their parents didn't go, what do you want to name her? Scooter. All right, come on. Well, you know, they could have waited. <laughs> oh, Scooter.
scooter. I have performance and don't put pressure on me. Um, performance and no, no, <laughs> anxiety. Good lord, yeah, I, I'm, I'm envious of people who can't perform. Yes, that's not me. Good lord, see, proving my point. I think you're just Good out of lord. touch in more ways than one. All right, come on, Scooter. Oh, my gosh. Technology. When I was going to coin shows at like 14 years old, I never thought it would end up something like this. Well, it's because YouTube and the internet wasn't invented. Heck, they barely had uh, phones, Color with, TV. phones with push buttons on them. That's right. All right, come on. 72, not the DD Oster. Six rolls remaining for Scooter Roni. Baseman, I've got a great idea for a new Baseman song. Oh, no. <clears throat> As soon as I finish the lyrics, I'm gonna. Yeah, I gotta pay somebody to sing it because I can't sing it. Cannot sing it. Five rolls remaining. Let me put these. Well, you can see them. There you um, go. This may sound strange. Can I take a shot at it? And sing it? Yeah. Uh, yeah, sure. I have so much time these days. Yeah. Well, we have 222 watching. Thank you for joining us. We are hunting for silver half dollars and we're doing the hunts for free for people in the chat. We've already found, well, we've only found three 40% silver half dollars, but we have found silver and we found it for people in the chat. So if you're over 18, you live in the US of A and you want a chance to win a free 10 roll half dollar hunt, just uh, say something in the chat. We also give away free dollar bill hunts where we look for fancy serial numbers and rare bills, and we do free nickel hunts, which aren't that exciting, but it's still free. <laughs> Michael Irison, greetings. Uh, Greg Siebold, my position was eliminated. Yep. So the wife is no longer interested. <laughs> Sorry, it took me a second to unmute it and mute it back. Come on, Scooteroni. And don't forget, subscriptions this week are free. So hit that subscribe button. 388 now. We just got a big influx in from the YouTube shorts feed. We are hunting for silver half dollars for free for people in the chat. So if you want to participate and win a free hunt and maybe find something silvery, just uh, be over 18, live in the U.S. of A, and say something in the chat. And if you haven't subscribed, we do free hunts three times a week. So be sure to hit the subscribe button, click the notifications bell, and if you can't hang around the night, join us during another stream, which will be probably on Monday. Well, Scooteroni, sorry, nothing silvery in your rolls at all. But there's still, there's still, hold on, where'd it go? So, so you're, you're telling, telling me there's a chance. Yeah! yeah! There's still a chance for other people. We've got, uh, what, three more wieners in this box, and then we've got another box behind me here that we'll do tonight. So go ahead and say <clears throat> something in the chat. Andrew Abalho, greetings. Mohawk Silver, welcome. All right, let's pick the next wiener. Here we go. Brian V. Brian V has won the next 10 rolls. Good luck, Brian V. Let's see if we can find something silvery for Brian V. Oh, gee. I think it would make sense for Scooter to be named that at birth because, I mean, if they waited a couple of weeks and then put her on the floor and then she started moving around a little bit, Hey, yeah. What do you call her? Oh, she's good. 
she scooted. Maybe maybe she was uh, conceived while Boot Scootin' Boogie was being played. Oh uh, yes. And they were gonna call her Booty, but they thought, no, that's not that's that's probably not Booty. <laughs> Let's call her uh, Scooty. No, that doesn't that doesn't Boot Scooty. No, Boot Scooter. Excellent idea. I like Scooter. Well, I think it's it's not as troubling for her to be called uh, Scooter. Um, oh, Scott H. Um, than it is for her to be called a wiener. I, I think it's not as, as bad for her to be called Scooter. No, that's true. That is true. Scott H., I have not. And, oh, you get dumb. Okay. Oh, uh, woman on the airplane? No. Thankfully, yeah, I'm not. No, there's going to be a whole... <laughs> oh, Scooter. Uh-oh, now i got to go. Scooter must have said something already dirty. Oh. Um. <laughs> <laughs> All right, roll number four think, for Brian. I think I made your think, which is what we do here. Yeah, me. We don't think a lot, but we make everybody else think. I think um, Southern Metal Saints really likes drama. That's no, I'm more of a... Why you bring me in here. I don't really like drama. I'm more of a sci-fi fan. Well, Carlos? as far as... Buenas, Muscle shell. Oh, Mu Buenas Noches, Carlos. Carlos, yes. Vio con Dios, Muscle Shell. Come on. See, because uh, Southern Metal has really grown his channel. And he brings me here in hopes that I don't accidentally run people off. So I think that's the... Uh, Ooh. Oh, boy. Named Scooter after, I assume, she bought first Harley Davidson. I think Harley would be better than Scooter. That's if you buy a moped. Right? No. Nah, no. Nah, see, that's the... Uh, if you got a Harley, you really don't give a... Piece of dumb what people call you. Wow. Come on, Brian V. Brian's like, all right, enough with the scooter chat. Find me some silver. Let's keep right, going here. And you can get our Southern Metal sweatshirt on Amazon, even though it's uh, about to be summer. That's what I'm wearing right here. Our Southern Metal sweatshirt. We also have t-shirts and pop sockets. <laughs> All right, come on. What is that? That's a dirty 90s half dollar here. Come on, Brian V. I know, Rob. I know. Let's go, Brian. Two more rolls remaining. There he is. There go. Our fearless leader. Who? Rob. Oh. Inconceivable. Last roll for Brian V. And dang it, Brian. Sorry. Nothing silvery there. Man. It would be nice to have three boxes in a row with a little bit of silver in it. We still have uh, 20 rolls remaining. That's not too bad. 20 rolls remaining. 74D, Negatron. All right. Thank you, Brian, for your support. Sorry the box is El Stinko tonight. Let's go ahead and pick the next winner. So go ahead and say something in the chat. You know what? Maybe if I refresh my 
beverage here with a, another Diet Coke. There's a little ASMR for you. And mark something. Where is it? Come on. Mark. Just subscribe and mark rocks. Just taking a second to appear in the chat. Oh man, all the fizz just went out of that drink. I hate that. I feel the need. The need for speed. All right, let's pick the next winner. Here we go. Brenda Shank. All right, Brenda, you got the next 10 rolls here. Good luck. Brenda, this box was dropped. I can see some of the rolls are coming apart of the seams on the bottom there. Whoop. I need a better roll delivery method. I'm having to reach over my iPad to get to everything here. All is, right. that is that troubling you in any way? Well, no, it's just, it's, it's awkward. Seem a little stressed, dude. I am stressed. No, actually, I'm, I'm quite relaxed. Emotional damage. <laughs> I should have seen that one coming. <laughs> All right, good luck, Brenda Shank. I think I did. I think I told you we went to your favorite sushi restaurant here in Atlanta. You did. And we ate 37 plates of sushi between three of us. I could have got you to 40. I think you may have been able to just barely get to get us to 40. All right, good luck, Brenda. Here we go, NC Who Prospects. <laughs> Whoop. Uh, Come on, play it. What? Oh, there we go. Oh, 72 Burner Fly. I can Don't add. Don't take any ideas from that. No. Nope. I can nope. add that. <laughs> I can add that to the fishing game. I certainly can. Uh, yeah. It will not be a pot. It'll. You'll have to have a disposal fee. <laughs> a jar of fish juice. If you missed it earlier, um, well. We'll continue with that right after this important message. Right next to the shiny one, I think that's a 90. If it's not a 90, it is a very shiny 69. Which that is, is definitely, definitely some, some good goodies, goodies right, right there. there. Yeah, silver right here. What did I just say, baseman? What did I just say? 1969. 40%er. I knew it. They always they always do that to you. But that's a 40% silver for Brenda Shankaroni. That's that's a silver in every box. Woo! -hoo! You're correct, Ric Flair. Let me update the board because we're on box number three. I'm not finding a ton of silver, but at least we're finding silver. Yes. Seven rolls remaining for Brenda Shank. 158 watching. Thank you all for hanging out with me and the one, the only, thank goodness, Baseman 64. <laughs> sure. Baseman was a wiener earlier as well. Yeah, maybe another one. Come on. But we only have uh, 10 rolls after this in this box. We do have the sister box. So... Always the next box. So basically, the my dump bank, one of my dump banks 
I got smart. They called me up and said, would you like to buy some quarters? Because I've been asking them if I could buy from their coin machine. All right. And I think they know, they figured out that if I, whoops, hold on, I dropped the coin. I think they figured out that if they sell me coins, that I won't dump coins there anymore. Yeah. Which is true. I don't like to do that. So, oh, zoom me out. Thank you, Emil. Stephen Biss says, zoom me out, please, Emil. And um, she called me up. She goes, I've got some quarters. Do you want them? How many do you have? $4,000 worth. I'm like, yikes. So, I took two bags and just went and deposit, deposited them at another bank. Yep, that's right, it's another silver. All right, there next to the next to a shiny one again. That's that's and there are the edges. Definitely a 40 there. All right, Brenda, here we go. It's going to be another <laughs> Another 1969, 40 percenter. That's crazy. That is crazy talk. So Brandon Shank has two 40s. So I was uh, explaining that to the bank where I normally do. I normally dump my coins, and I felt kind of bad. So I'm gonna buy pizza for them tomorrow. Oh, nice. And they are very happy. And they're like, you know, you can bring us your bags anytime. So I think I'm just going to go down to just having one dump bank versus three. Because the other bank started selling me coins as, as well. Thankfully, they only have, uh, they only require three large pieces. But do that once a quarter. That's not bad, right? Yeah, yeah. It's going to be probably like 70, 80 bucks, but once a quarter for the ease of not having to drive all over the place to dump my coins, that's well worth it. Uh, you might want to zoom out there again. Oh, shit. I mean, shoot. <laughs> all right, last... Now, wait a minute. There, there are people here with sensitive ears. I know. Sorry, man. Well, maybe not this chat, but... No. I mean, it was a guess. All right. Last roll for Brenda Shankster. Twilight Miz pizza does indeed make everything better. In yeah. fact, in some countries, it is seen as a medicine. All right, Brenda, congrats. Don't forget, Brenda, I need you to email me with your shipping address. Just to confirm, I don't know if you've ever won anything before. I don't remember. I am old and I do forget things, but that's a total. I haven't even updated the board. That's five forties through three boxes, base man. I think it's 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 almost funner. Is that, is that a word? To find a little bit in each box versus all in one box. Um, it depends on if you're grateful for the finds or if you're stressing between each one. Well, that's true. All right, congrats, Brenda Shank. And let's pick the next wiener, the last 10 rolls of this box. So, wow. So go ahead and say something in the chat. Yeah, unless it's hundreds of fines, you're correct. And it's going to be... Chaz, man. Chaz Aroni gets the last 10 rolls of the box. Can we get lucky and find silver in the last 10 rolls, base man? In the kind of sea bubble. bubble. Ooh. I can't find it now. <laughs> you give you 
is in the horror. I don't think it means what you think it means. All right, good luck, Chaz Man. Do I need to zoom out a little bit more? Yeah, there we go. Ten rolls for Chaz Man. Here we go. Let's get a 90. We need a 90 on the board. And, you know, we haven't found a proof in any of these boxes yet. That's always a good sign as well. The curse of the proof. So tell, you're telling me there's a chance. You know, he dated the uh, that actress in real life. After that, sort of ironic. I think he had his tooth fixed by then, though. Um, I'm what? Jim Carrey? Yeah, I'm trying to figure out if his teeth were... No, so the deal with his tooth is he actually had a cap. And he thought it would be funny if they took the cap off for the movie. And then he got he just, oh, he just got okay. it fixed again. See, that's what I was. Yeah. Okay. Were you a little confused there? Well, I was thinking the repair came first. No, the repair. I don't think he would say, "Yeah, chip my tooth for the movie." No, I no. He would have had to remove a repair. Yeah. That's what I was thinking. All right. Oh, there's another 74D. We're just checking for DDOs, just for just for funsies. Probably not start yet. All right. Roll number five for Chazzeroni, the South Jersey treat. Chazzeroni. Didn't quite take off, though, like Rasseroni did. No, no. It's kind of like those movies pizza, they pizza. used to advertise, like, if you loved, yeah, right, or if you like X, you'll love Y, and yeah. of course that movie was terrible. Yeah. From the producers of someone and Yes. Movie. You're like, oh, I like that first movie, and you go to the second movie, it was horrible. Yep. All right. Come on. Three rolls remaining. For Chazman. So, Base Man, YouTube is requ requiring that if you have something that is AI generated, that you disclose that in your stream. No. Uh -oh. So, if I ever bring back Robo Base Man, then I will. Um, <coughs> Have to disclose that to the uh, the people in the stream, like they would think that was real. Ooh, that's, <laughs> that's an unusual coin. Uh oh. Let me zoom in on that one there. See how dark it is. Hold on. That's what she said. <laughs> it's dark yeah, and, choke on that. It's dark and thick. And once again. <coughs> Did I play Angels yet? No. <sighs> I already took a peeky peek. Get ready for it. Hold on, I got to get the uh, little thing ready. That's what she said. Kennedy! Kennedy! We've got a 90. 1964 
out of Philly with some crazy we have Tony. Silver in this box. We have silver in this box right there. So Chaz Man, you get a free 90, not the DDO. And there is no mint mark. It almost looks like a uh, fire coin, but I think that's just, maybe it was stored improperly or something, but we got a 90 on the board. We have a 90 percenter on the board. If you just joined us, we have 264 watching. We're giving away free silver half dollar hunts to people in the chat. We just found a 90% silver half dollar for Chazman. Uh, so if you want to uh, participate, just say something in the chat. Be over 18 and live in the U.S. of A. We also do other streams where we give free hunts away. So if you haven't subscribed yet, click the subscribe button, turn the notifications bell on, and come join us for another stream where we give stuff away. No purchase necessary, void where permitted. The dealer retains all rebates. But that is... Uh, yeah, that's a 90 percenter. And the next to last. I for a dollar. <laughs> uh, that was in the next to last roll for Chaz Man. Yep. So that's that's sweet. I like that. Let me see. Is that a that's a Denver. One more roll out of this box, and then we have a one last box. So let's see if we can get a last roll silver. And no. All right, Chaz, man, you got a 90. Don't forget to email me with your mailing address to claim your prize. Now, I won't, I won't ship it until the beginning of April. So if you're going to move between now and then, definitely let me know. <laughs> let me know. All right, that's a 90 percenter for Chaz, man. Congrats. Chaz man, that is a nice find. That is a nice find. All right, and go ahead and say something in the stream. You will be picked to win a free 10 roll half dollar hunt. Courtesy of your friends at Southern Metal. Well, we're not really. Could there be the 90s or 64 and before? Yes, 1964 and earlier, or 90% silver. So, so far, let's do a quick recap. For those of you that just joined us, we have found five 40 percenters, which you can see in the white uh, words down below. Five 40s and 190 for four different people. Uh, well, three, including base man. Um, so, let's go ahead and get the last box of the night right here. <coughs> Excuse me. Lucky... Sippy sip. So go ahead and say something in the chat for a chance to win a free 10 roll half dollar hunt. 328 watching. <clears throat> We're giving away free half dollar hunts to people in the I chat. I love, love great, great dishwashers. dishwashers. I do love great dishwashers. Um, We're giving away free silver half dollar hunts to people in the chat. So if you want to join us, all you have to do is be 18 or older, live in the U.S. of A, and say something in the chat right now for a chance to win. Lynn Hawks, welcome. Um, <clears throat> we just lost like 80 people. They're like, nah, I don't want anything free. But what are you going to do? Andrew, welcome. All right. <clears throat> Let's pick the next winner of the next 10 roll hunt, and it's going to be, actually, you know what? We've got to bless the box first. Let's bless the box with the, uh, gee was we're running out of things. Let's just do pizza rolls again. <laughs> All right. Pizza, and, pizza. And the first winner of the box is... The craftiest of all dragons. Well. Good luck, crafty dragon. Here you go. Come on, silver enders and nothing <laughs> nothing silvery here. Man of Pillow Doom, I can understand the shock. Yes. 
Yeah. But you'll get used to it. We are hunting half dollars, looking for silver half dollars, and we're doing it for free for people in the chat. And we do a lot of other free hunts during the week, so if you haven't hit that subscribe button, go ahead and do it now and turn on that notifications bell. So you can join us when we have another stream where we hunt stuff for free for people in the chat. But the craftiest of all dragons has the next 10 rolls. And we've already found uh, five 40% silver half dollars and one 90% silver half dollars tonight for people in the chat. So that's how we roll. There you go. All right. Look, Look man, man, I ain't fall for no banana, banana in my tailpipe. tailpipe. Yeah, don't fall for the banana in the tailpipe trick. <clears throat> Trust me. Eddie Eric Murphy. Walton, so close. Eric, welcome. Sexting. That's not... Come on, Eric. All right, good luck. Craftiest of all dragons. Let's see if we can find anything <laughs> silvery for crafty. We've had three boxes out of three with silver tonight, base man. I think that is a... Well, I won't say a record, but certainly a strange occurrence there, but... Punk hazard, there are no punks here. So this is a punk hazard free zone. Yep. I don't even know what punk is. Punky Brewster? Nope, no purchase necessary. Free of charge. Probably somebody somebody who uh, runs their mouth and can't back it up. Oh, yeah, yeah. Like, uh, so, um, we, those, we don't run our mouths because we know we can't back it up. Those people in uh, Clint Eastwood movies. Yes. Remember? Do you feel lucky? Yes, Pump? yes exactly. Yeah. I got you now. Sorry, we're old. It takes a little bit of, while, a little bit of time to translate all that young talk into old people talk. But we, we do a pretty good job of it. Yes. I uh, keep, uh, um, I keep uh, the uh, Urban Dictionary yeah. page. On standby. We got that bookmarked, the old Urban Dictionary. Yes. Somebody needs to come out with a suburban dictionary. Oh my gosh. Right? That would be funny. Yeah, that would be good. 348 watching. Thank you all for joining us. Yeah, we're doing free half dollar hunts for people in the chat. You know, other streams, you go to other streams, they want to charge you. I've seen some streams charge you five bucks a roll. For hunting half dollars, we're uh, we're free. You can't get mad at free. Well, you guess you could. You know, if you got a disease for free, that would really be good, would it? Hmm. You know. Well, you might be upset with something you got for free. Yeah, especially if you paid for it. Or it might require payment to get rid of it later. Oh you know, yeah. Penicillin shots aren't cheap. All right. That's right. We are hunting for the craftiest of all dragons. And oh my gosh, base man. What? Oh my gosh. Here we go. What? Come on, focus. We're going to be four boxes for four boxes with silver. Right there. We've got free silver for Crafty Dragon. Now I gotta change the focus, make sure it's okay. There we go. All right, here we go. 19. Hold on, hold on, come on. Stupid remote control. Where did it go? Where did it go? 19 si oh, shoot. 1965. 40%er, and the 65 is the lower mintage one. So there you go, Crafty Dragon. 1965, 40% silver, half dollar for free for Crafty Dragon. We now have 434 watching us, Base Man. So thank you all for just joining us. We are hunting half dollars for people in the chat for free. And if we find any silver half dollars in their rolls, we will mail it to them free of charge. Free, no purchase necessary, void where prohibited, dealer retains all rebates. We just found Crafty Dragon in 1965, 40% silver half. 
and we have found uh, that makes a total of 640s and 190 on our fines tonight for people in the chat. So if you haven't subscribed, hit that subscribe button, turn the notifications bell on, and join us later on or next week because we won't have any more free hunts this week. But we, we do three streams a week where we hunt uh, stuff for people in the chat for free. All right. I need to have like a uh, spokes model or something to say that where I can just press a button and hit it play, you know, let it play there. You know what I mean, bass man? Yeah. Find somebody that... Ooh, well, you can I also... if you could do like a... What's that? Chat AI or something? Yeah, there's... You can get those free spokes model things. Maybe I'll try that. But... Or you can also just read what's up in red up there. Free half dollar silver hunt for the chat. But... Uh, yeah, that's what we're doing here. 320 watching. Thank you all for hanging out. We've got four more potential wieners. So if you want to join us, just be over 18, live in the U.S. of A., and say something in the chat for a chance to win. We've had a lot of first-time wieners tonight as well, base man. Yes. Last roll for the craftiest of all dragons. Uh, no, that's just, I think that's just a dirty... Half, yep, it is. It's a dirty, can't even see it. Dirty 1971. <laughs> and actually, it's quite nasty. Well, Crafty, we did get you one 40% silver half dollar. 1965, that is the hardest one to find. So, congrats. Let me grab a zippy bag for you. And Crafty, Richard, it's not that bad. Yeah. Crafty Dragon. Congrats, Crafty Dragon. All right. James Green took a pre-work nap and missed a good bit of stream. James, we're on the silver tonight. Four boxes in a row, which never happens with silver. That's, uh, I think that's five <laughs> five different people that have, that have uh, free silver tonight. Nice. All right, let's pick the next wiener. And Crafty, you are welcome. Thank you for your support. Longtime channel member. Unknown Mausius, so here's the deal. You say something in the chat, like when you're directed, which could be now. Yeah, you want to say something now, unknown. Yes. Or maybe you already have, but don't take a chance. And then he has a gizmo in his computer to select a wiener. Yep. And then he picks a he searches roles for you, and if you if he finds silver for those in those roles, you get it. Yes, we hunt the roles for free. If we find anything silvery, just silvery, you'll get it in the mail. It takes uh, I, I ship once a month, so you won't get it right away. All right, let's pick the next wiener. It's going to be James Green. James Green comes in late, gets selected. Wow, that is typical of James. Always late to the party, but always the one that gets whatever you get at a party. Favor? Party favors? I don't know. All right. Good luck, James Green. There are your 10 rolls. Let's keep going and see if we can find some more silver. Now we're down to 176. A lot of people were like, you know what? I don't want free stuff. I don't want free stuff. That's... Base man, this is crazy. What? We got another 40 right here. I thought it may have been older because the edges are worn. <laughs> All right, James Green, here you go. I'm find my explosion. 1969, 40 percenter. By the line, how does this process work? Uh, you just have to be over 18, live in the U.S. of A., and say something in the chat for a chance to win a free 10-roll hunt. And if we find anything silvery like we did now, we will mail it to you free of charge. 1969, <laughs> 40 percenter. James is like, yeah, looks like I joined this stream at just the right time but we someone also asked how often do we stream we stream four to six times a week we give away the 
uh, free hunts about three times a week. We also hunt nickels, dollar bills, and then of course every Thursday night is half dollar hunts with the world famous, world renowned bass player, Bassman64 over there. You may uh, notice him from several videos that used to be on MTV, but they're not any longer because MTV is, I don't even know what they do now. So thank you all for joining us. Let's see, we've had four boxes with silver. I don't think we've had that ever that I can remember. And we're hunting rolls now for James, Mr. Green Jeans. Wouldn't that be kind of weird to be? That would be Mr. Bermuda Shorts. <laughs> Could they not come up with another name for Mr. Green Jeans? Um. What's going to be the essence of your character? Well, I wear green uh, jeans. Really? Brilliant. That's your name right there. His wife's name is Mrs. Sundress. Wow. Bet they couldn't use that. Yeah. It blends too well together. Uh, Richard Cornell, I was once when I visited. You were once what? In the Rock and Roll Hall of Fame. <laughs> Ertl Turtles, uh, thanks for coming in. Thanks, Ertl. Have a great night. All right, come on. James Green. You know, I thought by increasing the number of rolls, baseman, to 10 that I'll have less to mail out. That is not the case tonight. Well, you increased the number of boxes, too. Yeah, well, well, we've been at four boxes for a while, but yeah. Uh, yeah, we were doing five rolls per person, and then I had to mail out 30 packages last month. Oh, I thought, wow. I thought, you know what, let's bump it up to eight, and then we bumped it up to ten. And uh, I, think, I think ten is going to be the right number, though. Stream is going by a little bit faster than normal. So, the base man is uh, almost past his bedtime now. Well, it's only 8, 8.22, your time. That's not bad. Yeah. You're, you're doing yep. okay. I think that's a dirty one. Is that a dirty one? Yep, dirty 1971. But, um, all right, come on. And Baseman, I don't know if you saw my post, since you don't subscribe, but um, <laughs> we did have our four-year anniversary of the channel this week. And we've only been live, well, we've been live streaming, uh, I think it'd be four years in like July. Four years in July we've been doing live streams. And you've been here with me like for three of those years. At least. I need to go back and see the first time Baseman co-hosted here. 319 in the chat. Thank you for joining us. We are hunting for silver half dollars. We found quite a bit tonight. and But we're giving the hunts away to people in the chat for free. So we've got six people, I think, that have free silver coming their way. Well, five people, including Baseman. All right. Last roll for James Green. So go ahead and say something in the chat for a chance to win. That's not silver. That's plated, I think. We've got something that looks silvery. Let me show it to you. That, see, that looks plated to me. Well, hold on. Let me, let me focus it a little better. See that? I don't know. Yeah. Dang it, Jim. It is not silver. It is a plated bicentennial. Why the heck would you go to the trouble to plate a bicentennial? Not silver. Just a plated bicentennial. It looks like they plated it with chrome. But um, what are you going to do? All right. Jane, um, yeah, James, we, did, we do have 140 for you. So not bad. Not bad at all. The Oster Negaroni. All right. Yep, false alarm. I knew it did not look silvery. It looked plated. 
Okay, Richard Cornell in the chat. I have never been a truly professional musician. Do you, have you ever played music and got paid? Oh, God, yes. You're a professional. Not. You are a professional well, musician. But you know what I'm saying. Yeah. It's a space station. Congrats, James Green. So if you want to win a free 10-roll half dollar hunt where we can find something silvery for you for free, be over 18, live in the U.S. of A., you don't have time to move before the stream ends, and say something in the chat. All right, James, there you go. Six wieners tonight. We've got all these people with uh, free silver coming their way. Baseman is the uh, is tied with Brenda Shank, two silvers. But uh, the Chaz Man has the lone 90% silver. So we'll say Chaz is winning for now. Eric Walton has been a great silver night. You are correct. So let's pick the next winner, and it's going to be Indigon Demon. Congrats, Indigon. You get the next 10 rolls on the price is free. That's right, free roll hunts for people in the chat. Maybe need a little jingle or something, base man. Hmm. That would be interesting, right? 256 watching, yep, free silver half dollar hunts. Hang out with us. We've, we've only got two more wieners for tonight. And if you haven't subscribed, go ahead and hit that subscribe button because subscriptions this week are free. All right, good luck, Indigon D. Mon. Can we get any more, any more silver? Are we up to, are we up to date on the uh, silver? I think we have seven, right? Yeah, I hold could, on. Yeah. Let me update the board here. Seven forties and one ninety so far. And out of this box, we have found a ninety and a forty. Is that right? I think so. Yeah. Okay, Richard Cornell, I was in cover bands, which when you're not <clears throat> when you're not good enough to be a professional in your main line of work, uh, you don't write music, whatever, but you're good enough to play it. You're, you're basically a trained monkey. Then you do cover music for weddings and conceptions and funerals and whatever the hell will. And, like, you'll play in bands or bars and stuff. Dave. So the largest audience I've played in front of would be roughly, I'll say, 1,200 people um, at a New Year's Eve event that we put on ourselves. And this was in Iowa, where the uh, entertainment is lacking and the competition is limited. <laughs> And uh, we were uh, we were appreciated. Better than tipping cattle. Well, is it? No, I was just being kind. Oh, thank you. Yeah. All right. Come on, Indigon. Roll number five for Indigon Demon. Is that one there? No. Dirty seventy-one. And we also had. Uh, David Kale just described, and David Kale Ross. Thank you, David, for subscribing. We appreciate it. Yep, subscriptions are free this week. Derek Cameron, I grew up there, so. Yep. Don't hold it against him. Richard Cornell, that has never happened. Better than getting booed off stage? Yeah, well. Come on. Come on, roll. Open up there. Hello, Oh, thank you, Mel. Lucky sippy sip. Don't forget, Monday night, we'll probably be doing free dollar bill hunts for the chat. Probably around 7 o'clock, but I don't know yet, because it's I usually don't know until about 20 minutes before I stream. 
So hit that subscribe button, turn the notification bell on, and join us on Monday nights for free dollar bill hunts. Always have a good time hunting dollar bills. Basement, we found several binary notes lately, which is, uh, I hadn't found a binary note until I started giving the hunts away. <laughs> All right, come on, Indigon Demon. Two more rolls remaining for Indigon Demon. Broella, where is the link for membership? Let me type member. I think it's right there. Return. There you go. See if that pops up. All right, dang it, nothing silvery there. You've seen Napoleon Dynamite, have you not? I have not. Oh, really? No. Richard Cornell? No, but I'm about to. <laughs> Last roll for Indigon Demon. And. Dang it, Indigon. Sorry, brother. Nothing silvery there. Yeah, how is it going with your potential new band? Um, it's. I got the song list, and um, I know some of them. Um, how can I do this? All right, let me pick another winner while you think about it. we got two more wieners left. Good luck, everybody. Here we go. And the next wiener is Stephen Biz. Oh, nothing popped up. Membership? I would type membership. Join, maybe? Give me one second. One second here. Stephen Biz has the next 10 rolls. All right, baseman, go ahead. Okay. <laughs> so I'm, I'm in a band um, just for funsies. It's a bunch of old dudes who get together and still have some gas in the tank. We're, we're not really doing it for money or anything. We're just getting together to have some fun. And um, so I'm doing that. But the, uh, the more serious uh, venture is from a wildly talented um, musician who has uh, three gold records and a platinum record on his wall that I've seen in person. He, um, because of uh, songwriting credits. And he wants me to play bass for him which makes no sense to me. Well, he needs a bass player. Thank you, Indigon, for hanging <laughs> out. All right, I've just found the link. Broella, thank you very much. All right, Stephen Biz, you get the last, or not the last, you get these 10 rolls, and then we have one more wiener for tonight. And Metal Dragon, thank you for joining us. YouTube didn't. YouTube failed to notify Metal Dragon. All right, Mr. Moist himself, Stephen Biz. Good luck. Here we go. So you just got to learn the songs, and then you're going to start jamming. That's yeah, this. Um, I'll listen to them. If, if I've never heard the song, I'll listen to it like five times, and then I'll play it. Uh, if I have heard the song, I'll I'll probably have it after the second time I play it. Short Potato, he is pretty good, isn't he? <laughs> I've been doing this for four years. Hold on. Where is it? Where is it? It's been 84 years.
All right, good luck, Stephen Biz. Here we go, roll number three. Yep. But I tell you what, I'm I'm fairly fast. Lob who finds the treasure. Oh boy, is a beast. I mean, he is just he just he goes through there like crazy. All right, come on, come on. You know, if we had a get approved, that's a fill the board. No, do we have a miscellaneous? No, we don't have a miscellaneous yet. No, we do. Yeah, we do. We, we did find a DDL. That's right. We just need a proof. Philip Smith has inherited a buttload of so much silver. What's the best way I can figure out what everything is worth? Are you talking about silver coins or just bars of silver? What you got there? What you got? And Robert Taylor just subscribed, and Robert Taylor rocks. Thank you, Robert. What do you got? You've piqued my interest now. You had me at butt load. <laughs> yes, he has a... Uh, uh, how do you say? Voiding problems? Kiwi effect. What am I watching? You are watching... A couple of dudes uh, weren't, weren't making trouble in their neighborhood. And we got into a fight, and Mom got scared and said, we're going to move you to your auntie and uncle on Bel Air. Now, that's not what we're doing at all. What we're doing is he does the hard work, goes to the banks, gets the boxes of half dollars. I sit here and run my mouth. He searches the coins with gloves. Then, um, when he directs, you say something in the chat. And if you are so chosen, then any silver he finds in those 10 rolls goes to you. Yep, free silver half dollar hunt for people in the chat. Yes. Any DDOs I find, though, I keep. Gotta get something out of doing this. And we have found a pretty good amount of silver tonight. Yep. Not a lot, but a pretty good amount. I'm happy with it. I won't be complaining until next week. All right, chat, you have to promise me something. You have to get your copy and paste out. Uh, Kiwi Effect, yes, we are. In fact, we will show and tell. This is one I like. See if that shows up nicely. This is the Seated Liberty $1, 1864. Liberty was seated because I guess you needed to break Civil War times and stuff. Once you get tired while they sit there and carve each coin out. True. All right. Mm. And this is uh, more recent quality. What was the question? Please. I missed the question. All right, James Green, have a great night. All right, come on. Two more rolls for, I forgot who we're hunting for. Stephen Biz. And then we got one more wiener for tonight, and then we will close it out and be back. Um, I may stream over the weekend. I, I don't know. I may do pennies because that's all I have left to hunt. Last roll for Stephen Biz. But definitely try to be back Monday night when we uh, hunt dollar bills for fancy serial numbers. Well, Stephen Biz, sorry, nothing silvery in your rolls. We tried, Stephen. We tried. All right, last winner of the night. Go ahead and say something in the chat. Baseman got that seated. What did you pay for that seated baseman? No, it's seated Liberty. <laughs> he didn't pay a damn thing for seated baseman. <laughs> they just look alike. That's really not him on the That's coin. That's true. Yeah, we both aged like a Sean Connery. Yeah. All right, the last wiener of the night is Two Bits John. All right, Two Bits, you do get the last. 
10 rolls of four bits. Did you ever have a cheer in high school, two bits, four bits, six bits, a dollar? Uh, yes. Yeah. Very popular chant there. All right, good luck. Two bits, John. Here we go. See if we can squeeze some more silver out of this box. People are texting me in the middle of the stream, bass man. Man. Who would do that? All my friends are here. Who's texting me? <laughs> All right, good luck. Two bit of Roni. Come on. See, I'm not going to say it would be nice to find one more silver in this box because that would be almost like complaining. And I don't. It do, would be. I don't do that. I'm not going to say, man, it would be nice. That's your reward for not complaining. It was an right there. It was an ender. 19, right there. 1967. That's your reward. Think about that. 40 percenter. I want you to sit in the corner and think about that. I didn't even see it. It was on the end. I didn't even I didn't even check it. It had to be on the uh, on the bottom end because I would have seen it. Let me, let me check these other ones. That's a, that a 77. Yes. Yeah, the 70. one time he doesn't look at the bottom end. Yep. All right, two bits, John. You're on the board with a forty percenter. Nice. Uh, let me go add that to the stream. We are back on the silver. That is sweet. See, we've got a DDO here. Uh, Negatron DDR. Those are a little tougher to spot. Uh, no. All right, two bits, John. 1967 40 percenter. -y. That's a uh, nine. All right, baseman. We need one more for ten. We need one more for ten silvers of the stream. <laughs> yeah, my that was not the wife texting me. She's actually at Drunko. I mean Bunko. <laughs> I don't think she's home yet. Whoops, come on. Yeah. No, it was my son who, uh, Chris who said the lights upstairs flickered and he wondered if I lost the stream. No, no, that must just be an upstairs electrical issue. No, there's no puddle beneath me. Yeah. All right, come on. Two bits. John, DDO, Megatron. Six rolls remaining. 201 watching, thank you for hanging out. We've been finding silver tonight for people in the chat. So if you want to join us next Thursday night as we hunt more half dollars looking for silver for people in the chat for free, I mean, the hunt's for free and you can watch for free, and subscriptions are free this week, just hit that subscribe button, turn the notifications bell on, because we do three free hunts, or three streams per week with free hunts, something like that. What? Yeah. Something like that. Free hunts for the people in the chat. Four rolls remaining. After this baseband, you know what you're going to need to do? Uh, get to the chopper! Get to the chopper. Arnold says get to the chopper. <sighs> Yep. Yeah. Come on. So we can find a DDO again. Negative. Negative. All right, three rolls remaining. Four. Two bits, John. All right, come on. Two bits. One more silver would give us 10 on the night. Two rolls remaining. I mean, the odds are high, but... So you're telling me there's a chance. Yeah! 
The Kiwi Effect just subscribed and the Kiwi Effect rocks. Thank you, Mr. Effect. Or Mrs. Effect. I don't know, is fruit male or female? Yep, just a dirty 74. Hey, speaking of the wife, we uh, we used to play tennis together, mixed doubles, and then they came out with this pickleball stuff. <clears throat> oh, yes. But if you're, you're I used to play, um, what's the thing where you play indoors? Racquetball. And I... Uh -oh. When you okay. play when you play racquetball, the motion of your wrist is different than tennis, and so when you go play tennis, you, you're you're messed up, right? You're you're all over the place. Um, they came out with pickleball, which is the same thing as racquetball, right? It messes up your swing. So they came out with this new thing now at our. I don't know if it's nationwide, but I know it's at our club. It's called quiet tennis, and, and basically you just play it without all the rackets. All right, last roll of the night. Come on. And dang it, Jim. Nothing silver there, but we did. We had a good stream. Nine silvers. <laughs> we found nine silvers for people in the chat for free. So if you just joined us and wondering what the heck we're doing, we're hunting half dollars, looking for silver half dollars. Four people in the chat, and we do it for free. And this one, this 1967 half dollar is going to go to Two Bits John. So Two Bits John, don't forget, email me with your mailing address to claim your prize. And uh, that was pretty good, Bass Man. That was pretty good. We got one for Two Bits John, two for Bass Man. One for Broella, a 90 for Chasman, one for James Green, one for Craftiest of All Dragons, and then two for Brenda Shank. So that's uh, how many How many people have silver? Three, four, seven people. We found silver for seven people tonight. Can't get mad at that even though I was like, if I increase the number of rolls, it'll be less to mail. That theory is now shot. Good night, Jeff. Thank you for hanging out with us. Well, base man, that was that was not bad. That was not bad. No, not at all. At all. NC Prospector says my neighbor's upset with our country club because we are occupying the gym where they play on Saturday. They're having a coin show. Well, they can just get over that, NC Prospectors. And I didn't know they had country clubs in North Carolina. That's amazing. Get lit says I have a 2023D Washington Quarter air on nose of George. I'm assuming it's a die crack. I would have to, you probably have to go to eBay to see how much they're going for. It could be five bucks, it could be ten bucks. I, I, I don't know what they're going for right now. It's a pretty common error though. It is a pretty common error. But thank you for the question. Well, that's well it. You, but it might have some sentimental value for it, uh, especially if you pick the nose. I mean, pick the coin. All right, let me get rid of some of these sounds here. <laughs> yeah, tonight it was the boxes were definitely on fire. Ah! Oh, I gotta move that down a little bit. It's a little too high. Whoa. Uh, Broella, it might be oh. because you're watching on your phone. Yes. Don't forget to tip your waitresses, everyone. Oh. Exactly. All right, everybody. Well, that's it for tonight. We have uh, one ninety percenter, eight forties, zero proofs. Oh, we did have one miscellaneous. I forgot. Uh, and we had probably I don't know ten NIFCs. I don't really keep keep up with those anymore. But so that was it. Uh, but thanks for hanging out with me and the ultra famous. Bass player, huh. bass man 64 plays bass. If you want to go check out his channel, uh, he might have some videos on there from like three years ago. But uh, <laughs> <laughs> but anyway, because it's true. 
yeah, thanks for hanging out with us. We appreciate it. Y'all have a great uh, rest of the night and a great weekend. We may stream Saturday night or maybe Sunday night. I'm not sure. So be sure to hit, hit the uh, notifications bell and you can join us for that. Uh, until next week, y'all have a great night and good luck with your hunts. And until then, bye.